Okay, hi there, I'm Carl at Escape Trailer, and today I'm gonna to talk to you about durability and why you would want to purchase a one-piece fiberglass travel trailer. Now, a lot of people don't know much about fiberglass or, or what it is, so we're gonna give you a quick sort of tour of the process of making a one-piece fiberglass travel trailer. I'm just gonna quickly show you something. Here's an example of, the, of somewhat the finished product. This is what we call gel coat on the outside. It's a white, beautiful exterior. And then we have what we call the fiberglass on the inside. And fiberglass is in fact made of glass mixed with resin. We're gonna show you some, fiber, some actual glass in a second. Then we have our insulation. And then of course, on the very inside of the trailer, you have this beautiful heavy loaded foam, or sorry, foam with a heavy loaded vinyl on the front. You know, this on the inside of your trailer is gonna be very cold and stark. That's why we have this beautifully comfortable, soft, interior finishing. But let's go through the process here for making a beautiful one-piece fiberglass travel trailer, and then we'll talk about why we believe, why that is important. This is a mold. Everything starts in a mold. So it's not panels that we stick together, right, that can then break or fall apart. Because remember, the wind and all the forces on the road are trying to take your trailer and twist it and turn it and tear it apart. And we have joins and seams all the way along that trailer or even on the roof or even where the sides connect to the roof or connect to the sides, eventually it's gonna leak and that's a problem, but not for a one-piece fiberglass travel trailer. So we start off in the mold. The first action here will be to spray the gel coat, so the white part that gets sprayed first and then we get into spraying the fiberglass. Now I said I'd show you what the actual glass looked like and it comes like this. Right, so this is glass, and this was first discovered back in the 1880s of all time. And we take this glass, and it goes through a gun, a special gun, and the gun will chop the glass and spray resin with it, and put it all together, like a almost like a paper mache sort of style, but a hell of a lot stronger than that. So I kind of get you a, an idea of what this is like. Fiber glass, or the glass part in FRP, fiber reinforced polymer, you could say, and this will be a fiber reinforced glass polymer, um, has been used extensively since about the 1950s. And indeed the Corvette was made of fiber glass. Now the reason for it is fiber glass gives you, you some unique properties. It will not rot, it will not dent, it will not decay. Yet its strength and materials in terms of this and flexibility is better than most metals. So you imagine if this was aluminum and I was trying to bend this, it will bend, but it will not go back to where it was. If I dent it, it stretches the material if it's aluminum, not with fiberglass. Beautiful part about fiberglass, and this is why it's built um, been in a lot of cars, and, since, and rail cars are huge on fiberglass, is because it's very repairable. So if this were to be damaged, it's very easy to grind it out and fix it up and make it look brand new again. So a real great values for fiberglass. Stronger than most metals, more flexible, and very easy to repair. Now, what we do is we have two molds. We have a bottom mold and we have a top mold on these trailers. Then with the bottom mold, again, we do the gel coat and then the fiberglass on the inside and we do the same on the top mold. We let them cure and we take them out of our fiberglass booth area. We'll walk around here and we'll just have a look at some some finished trailers. We take the two molds and we stack the molds on top of each other. When we stack the molds on top of each other, then we go inside the mold. Now you're not gonna see this very well, but as the example, we go inside the mold and we essentially, using fiberglass again, or resin, we bond or weld the two pieces together. Now, it's, once, that, once that's done, they're pretty much fused together. It's not going to crack or split along that line. And that's what gives us the one piece structure. And you see that one piece structure over here. And you see all the markings and stuff that we have on the trailer. And they're really from, for us, from a quality perspective, just to identify work that we need to do to these trailers before they leave. So they're beautifully finished and beautifully polished for you and um, the customer when you receive your trailer. Um, flexible yet strong. Now this doesn't mean they're like wet noodles running down the road. Of course, all the cabinetry and, and fittings that we put on the inside also seek to stiffen up the trailer even more. But it's, um, its durability really is a testament of time. And you can see that with the Escape Travel Trailers, especially with the pre-owned Escape Travel Trailers on their resale value. Everybody will pay for something that's gonna last a long time. And the resale value on our trailers is second to none. 
um, you know, you can't really buy a five-year-old trailer for any cheaper than what the person paid five years ago. In fact, sometimes that price even goes up just a little bit, just because they last for so long. And the recovery work on fiberglass is beautiful. You can have that trailer. These are all very UV, these are all UV stabilized now, some scrape products on the gel coat side of things. But you polish your trailer up every year and it will look beautiful for, well, I mean, 10, 15 years. We've been doing this for 19 and I have seen some trailers from 17 years ago that, you know, with a good polishing, they look absolutely beautiful on the inside and the cabinetry and everything on the inside has stayed incredibly well maintained because everything is so stiff on the outside or it's flexible yet stiff on the outside that nothing is cracking and so you have a strong base and so you have a strong interior and especially the way we build it and just leads to an exceptionally durable product that will last you really a lifetime okay thank you everybody i hope you like this if you do like and subscribe i'm carl at escape trailer and we're built for you